hi you are welcome back to the channel if you are new here you are welcome if you are a returning subscriber you are welcome today we are coming to learn how to make this back lace and zip tutorial so if that's what you want to learn then let's get right into the video this is the fabric that we we'll use this one is the main fabric for the zip and the zip line then we will use this one for the um that small place with the eyelet so this is my tools for the highlight so let's get right into the video and this is the zip so let's get right into the video so this is our fabric we'll divide it into two that means double and lining so we'll divide it into two like so so i'll divide it into two like this so it's a double and it's lining so this is how it will look so let's take it here is the zip line this is the zip line uh -huh. let's make it like this this is the zip line so we'll cut the fabric for the eyelet at the back so you cut it that one to double so this is the like so so this is it we we'll add stiff you fold it into two you iron it you put stiff at one side and the other side then you you sew it and turn it over so let me go and sew it and bring it for us to see so this is it this is the zip zipper line but i want us to make that here like the princess that so that we insert the bone in like the way we see the back so we we'll divide here into two then we did that divide here into two then you sew is double this is it the stiff is at one side you sew only the ends like so the hands so this one will come in will go inside the princess that i hope i'm making sense so let's divide it into so it's four each with its lining so let's divide here first then we divide here again so this will serve as a dart so we divide that one two into four so we have eight pieces so this is our dart so before we do it we'll put this in it and so so we'll sew here and here so let me go and do it and bring it for us to see so this is it this is your back pieces so this is the one side this one is one side this one is one side so you take one both like this so you are joining your princess like so so this is your lining then you take this one to you. Then you join. You join it like so. So this is how it will look when you finish joining. So we'll join this. Then this is the back piece. So this is the eyelet that we we'll use. So you place it here. You place it here. When you sew, then it will come here. I hope I'm making sense. So let me iron it well and bring it. So this is it. This is it. You put one here. You put it here. Then you put this one on top. Make sure where the stiff will come. That place will show. So like this. Then you put this one on top. 
then you pin it down then here to you place it like so i want the sleeve to show so so you place it like so mm -hmm. then you sew it i want to make sure everything is equal so we we'll sew here then we we'll open we we'll open it will be like this like so then this one too will be here then here will be our zipper line so this is where we we'll lace i hope i'm making sense so let me go and join it and bring it for us to see so this is it this is it so top stitch it it will go here it will come here like this wait see so top stitch here then we add bone to give it structure to stand well so you top stitch here it depends on the size of the uh, bony you are using if you are using the rigid bony but i prefer you use the plastic bony so i'll go and sew here as a case in the uh, bone casing so that or bone channel then we use it inside so let's pin the zip line first so this is our guard line as the zipper line so this is our zipper line like so like this so we'll top stitch here then we we'll top stitch here then we insert our boning before we use the facing to turn the top i hope you understand so this is our boning the boning that we we'll use to insert here you can see the stitches i made i did like so so you make sure you sew it here then this one will be like this so here the eyelet and this one will be the zipper line so you measure your bone you leave about a uh, three quarter an inch at the top so let's make it the bone should be nine and a half inches so that's what i'll cut here right now so we'll cut nine and a half then you cut another one it's double like so then we put it aside because this one is a plastic bony i use it on the wall like this i hope you can see to give me that clean edges so that it won't be too sharp if it's sharp it will poke the fabric so you use you do it like this that's how I do mine, like so. Then you do the other one too, like so. So now we have our boning nicely. So now we are coming to insert it. It's like you are making your corset. So see, it's going inside. So you see. So the bone fits perfectly well. So this is it. Then we put here to we insert the bone in here like so. Like so. So I'll go and iron it. Then I'll use my lining to turn the top. Then I'll fix the zip and bring it to for us to see how it will go then i'll fix my eyelid so that we see how the finish you so you use this is your back piece you sew it like the way you do your normal you just put this thing in the princess that then you sew then you top stitch it and you add your boning if you want more boning you can do more add more boning at the size then you do so i'm going to turn it with the lining then i'll fix the zip then i'll do my eyelid and bring it to and for us to see the finished look so this is it this is the finished look this is it so I'm now coming to do the eyelet mark the eyelet so it depends on how you want it you can do one inch this one is just illustration so let's do it one and a half one and a half one and a half then we leave here so one and a half one and a half one and a half one and a half 
so this is it so we have one two three four five one two three four five so i'll make the eyelids and bring it for us to see so i've done some off camera i want to i want you to see how i fix my eyelids so this is it i've bid my holes already i'm inserting the eyelids like so then i'll add my washer like this then I, I place it here like so then you add your metal like so so this is it I finish fixing my eyelid so you left with last one let's fix it then we add our washer like so then you place it on your bottom shell then you add your two like so we are done so this is it i hope you can see so this is how this is the bone there's a bone here this is it the zip i made it such a way that you can remove it like a jacket zip if you want to sew it like a corset there's no need for you to add modesty panel at the back so you just make it like so so let's lace it so you make it like so then you lace it please if this video was helpful please give it a thumbs up so this is how it goes so this is it so your zip will be there then you lace if you want it to be a little tighter you tight it small then you tied your bow you are good to go so this is it this is our finished look i hope this video was helpful so this is it thanks for watching see you in the next one bye bye bye